to the Spy Valley Pinot Noir 2010, and you're mentioning that this is your project yeah. at Spy Valley. Can you tell us a little bit about it? Well, even though the uh, Pinot Noir is about 5% of uh, what we produce, half of the winery is built dedicated to making this wine. And uh, so during vintage, I run this side of the winery and, um, and take all of the fruit. So yeah, it's kind of my little baby. Yeah, yeah. it's great. The color is really lovely. It's it's a very nice kind of cherry red. Yeah, yeah sort of dark ruby. And on the nose, um, we get sort of lovely, yeah, dark cherry sort of comes to mind again. Um, some sort of mocha background. Yeah. And one uh, character that is very distinct from our vineyard is this sort of spicy licorice note. Yeah. Yeah, and it's uh, really lovely. I also pick up a little bit of a kind of cedar wood or, or mm -hmm. just a bit of that spice falling yeah. through as well. Yeah. Um, maybe a little bit of earthiness, I don't know. It's yeah, there is a, really nice. a lovely sort of layers of, uh, you know, f from that sort of feminine spectrum of the sweeter fruits right through to those earthy, sort of more masculine tones. Yeah. The palette, it's really nice. A lot of intense fruit here, again, very yeah. juicy cherries, juicy red berries. Yeah, yeah well, it's, uh, I sort of think it's got lots of layers of mm. intense sort of red fruits yeah. um, with a lovely sort of velvety, smooth, uh, earthy toned It's um, very tans. smooth. Yes. There's a, the acidity is there keeping it really lively, but yes. lots of layers kind of yes. developing. It's really nice. Yeah. It's drinking beautifully right now. When do you think is the best time to drink it? Well, I think, uh, yeah, as you say, it's drinking really well now, but um, I think in the next two years, I'd love to sort of see more of that sort of earthy uh, tones to sort of really Come lift out and sort of balance that bright sort of fruit. And food match, I'm going to suggest the classical uh, lamb, duck. Yeah. What would you, yeah, what do well, you drink? Um, currently, uh, my husband and I have been uh, drinking a lot of it with uh, Moroccan sort of oh, uh, styled lamb. That's um, a great idea. Yeah. yeah. Again, I good. think this is an amazing value, New Zealand Pinot Noir. I think, you know, so many wines are just over overpriced and this is just so well made and really good price point. Yes, exactly. Um, it has continuously won awards um, as best value for money and uh, wine state, decanter and uh, and right. the likes. Yeah. So people have already figured that out. Exactly, <laughs> yeah. Click on the bottles that you see for an individual tasting review by Kathy Lee and myself.